Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Amnesia The Dark Descent Blind. This is probably the 14th or 15th episode. I have no idea what episode it is. I am in a very freaky area. Why is it so laggy? Oh yeah. Okay. <laughs> Okay, so, recap of the last episode. We came in here. Hang on, I'm gonna restart this. Wait, no. I'm just gonna let my frame... What is up with my lagginess right now? It's locked. However, the lock is very corroded and weak. I wrote myself a little note. Let's just see what it says. One of the locked prison cells has a weak lock. Let's throw something at it. That works. Where is the lock? I hear the lima beans. There's one. Oh, viewer, it's so dark. I'm gonna cry. Ah! Holy goodness. Holy balls! Lay low, lay low, lay low. I hear it, holy crap. Oh no, what do I do? If it peeks through those bars in the window, I am going... I don't know what I'll do. There's nothing I can do, that's a problem. Alright, we're gonna have to go out there. Let Daniel regain his sanity a little bit and let's try it. <sighs> Wonderful. My lamp just went out. If I see it stalking the halls... Why is the mu- the music- the music is still playing, that means something. But mother, I don't want to leave without you. Hurry, child. You must go. Find Gabriel, the outrider, and tell him to alert the king's men. Help! You come too! Please, we don't have time to make the hole any wider. Oh, they're trying to escape. Oh, okay, there's a hole. Let's find it. It's beneath the bed, apparently. Oh, Daniel, you're so weak and fat and strong at the same time. The prison northern block. <sighs> the hole is too narrow to slip through. Wonderful. What did I write myself? There is a hole in the ground in one of the cells, but it's too small to fit a man. Do I have to all of a sudden become a woman? Uh, I don't know what to find. Was that? No. All right, that is scary. I get it. Tinderbox and some health. Oh, wonderful. 
Something's collapsing. What did collapse? Hopefully it wasn't something I needed. I don't know where to go. Where do I go? Alright, that's where I came from. Let's go to the gate. I hope this episode isn't too laggy. It, it's sort of choppy. I don't know why. That. Ah! What do I do? I heard a scary, weird noise, and uh, I'm running. I have to find another way around the gate. Great, this is going to be another three-episode little area, isn't it? I'm going to have to get around the gate, find some weird, strange, gay rock that I have to use to make myself a woman. Alright, I'm guessing I'm just going to have to throw some... Those are just ambient noises, don't worry, viewer. It's okay. I'm not scared. Alright, now I'm scared. There's beetles running on my screen. Ah! Okay, I'm gonna throw a barrel at the simple lock, or whatever it was. Stop with the lagginess! What is up? Lock is very corroded and weak. It's not working. Okay. Hammer! I'm an idiot. What? Hollow needle. How? It worked on the other door. Why don't why won't it work on this? And why wouldn't a hammer work? Let me through. Hammer. I'm gonna try this one more time. Nope. Apparently not. You know how deep we are, viewer? We're probably like a mile beneath Brennenburg. Ooh. I see something. Quiet. Maybe now we can get through it. A chipper. Yes. This will work. Let me in. All right. This barrel contains more than half a lantern worth of oil. I won't say no to that. All right. There's bones in here, which is always comforting. What else? Is that all that was in here? Are you kidding me? No, there's no way. It has to, there has to be something else in here. Nope, I don't see anything, viewer. Apparently, this room is just a distraction for good old Dread Isle trying to make me spend an hour of my time thinking about how to get through that lock when I'm in reality I'm supposed to be trying to go a different direction. Thank you, game. Alright, I'm gonna go back down these steps. <gasps> ah! Oh, junk. Viewer. Oh my gosh. I am hiding. I'm in a... Ah! Okay, I see it. It's coming up those stairs. Viewer. Oh no! <gasps> Running! Oh my goodness, viewer. It's coming right at me. Oh, okay, good. Yeah, you turn around before I hear it. Uh, 
I'm scared of it. <laughs> Why can't the game just be nice to me like every two seconds? Instead of mean to me every half a second. Alright, you know what's gonna have to happen here, viewer. The reason why the monster appeared is because there's something down there that we need, so we're gonna have to sneak past it or throw a barrel at its face. I'm leaning more towards the second. It's still around here somewhere. <laughs> All right, if all of a sudden it pops up, wham! I'm gonna throw a barrel up its nostril. All right, scary music stopped. But the scary sounds didn't. I'm just kind of searching around for crap I need. That was pretty intense. I think I know why it's so laggy. I'm in Skype right now. That might be... Daniel just talked to himself again. He's so dumb. Why can't he just give me a hint? Even a little hint. Instead of just rambling about weird things. Alright, I don't believe- okay, I have been here. This is the very- this is the elevator. Wonderful. I just went in a circle. A circle that was very, very, very scary to go through. Alright, well that door's locked. Maybe there's something we need in it. Any ideas, Dalton? Or Nath? And... So I have no idea what to do. Doesn't life suck, viewer, when scary things are trying to kill you? I heard a zombie noise. And what sounds like a jet airplane. Alright, I'm gonna go back up here. I think I might have an idea, actually. This means something. Why? Is there a way through? Okay, well, we're running up on our time limit in a minute. We're gonna have to stop it. How does one get around this? Hammer? Oh, hammer and a chipper. How about a hollow needle? Cannot use the item this way. Great. Super! Yeah. I've checked every room. What am I supposed to do? Alright. Well, I might as well stop it here until I figure out what to do. Ugh. Next time on Let's Play Amnesia The Dark Descent Blind. Hopefully I'll be able to figure out what I'm supposed to do because at the moment I'm clueless. See you next time.